Hey, what's up YouTube? Um, now today I'm just gonna show you guys, I, I got some latest updates yesterday, last night. I didn't do it last night because I was just doing the backup before I would install the updates. Now I did the Time Machine backup, I did the Carbon Copy Cloner backup uh, to my external hard drives of course. Now um, I did the software update check which is basically from here. And here is the result for that. So these are the new updates that I have as of now. It looks like it's mainly the iLife suite updates, you know. I mean the applications in iLife like iPhoto, iDVD, iMovie, iWeb, GarageBand, etc. So yeah, these are the small updates. Um, it doesn't say much. Uh, just gonna zoom in for you guys. Okay. So iWeb overall stability and addresses a number of minor issues. GarageBand a big list fixes issues with GarageBand Lesson Store. I never used it. Issues with some tempo-based effects falling out of sync. Never used it. Resolve problem with Magic GarageBand project files. I have never used these things in GarageBand. Actually, I have never used GarageBand so far. Um, I photo. I use it regularly, but that's just for some basic photo stuff. I don't do much in it. So yeah, but I'm anyways gonna install these updates probably because I'm I'm more worried about the upcoming Mac OS X Lion, the 10.7. So yes, I'm just gonna install all these updates. Now before I do the updates, I have already done the backup, but I want to make sure that there are no external hard drives, nothing at all connected to my computer as of now, to my Mac. So I'm just gonna remove all of them. I've already removed the external hard drives which normally show up on the desktop as they are connected. I'm just gonna also turn off the time machine. So yeah, there you go, it's on. I'm just gonna put the slider to off. That's it. So yes, the time machine is off now. And okay, so I'm just gonna click on install five items now. So I think it will start downloading. Okay, it is installed downloading. It says about nine minutes, eight minutes. Okay, yeah, I do have a a pretty good internet connection over here, but still, it's gonna take eight minutes. I'm not gonna let you wait, guys, for eight minutes. So as and when this is about to finish, I will be. Guys, back. it looks like the update is just about to get over. It's 588 MB. Okay, it's done. It's now validating the packages, so I reckon it has started the installation now. I really don't know how much time is it gonna take, and should I? Okay, it's it's pretty fast. It's happening fast enough. So these are the updates that I'm basically installing for iLife 11, um, the iMovie, iDVD iWeb, GarageBand, iPhoto and meanwhile while this is being done I'm gonna, I'm gonna just gonna show you how you set up automatic updates if, if anyone of you is new to Mac so it's basically I mean you just highlight the software update first it shows you the software update menu you go to preferences and there uh, you, you can see the check for updates uh, it should be daily, weekly or monthly it, it was by default weekly I have set it down to daily so it can do more checks and you can even see the installed software the software that you have installed so far so the installation looks like just about to get over soon if you if you guys are gonna install updates at all I would highly recommend that you do a backup of your system carbon copy cloner is a freeware utility you can do the exact image of your system so in case if your system goes down you can just use that external image on your external hard drive and boot up your system again okay so it just says the updates were installed successfully so no restarting the computer no other warnings nothing at all nothing to say that you have to quit some programs or whatever whatever so okay it's done it still shows iMovie as tick. I don't know what that means. Yes, all the software is installed and says your software is up to date. So which basically means we have installed all the updates. 
Now, as I said to you guys, if you want to check the updates that you have installed already, already I'm sorry, um, just going to go to software updates and it will automatically start checking for new software. Meanwhile, you can just go over here, software update preferences and go to install software. So there you go. It shows the date of the installation and which was today, 12th of July. So you have all these updates, iDVD, iWeb, iPhoto, GarageBand and iMovie, the updates that we did just today. That's it guys. So this was it for the video and thank you. Thanks a lot for watching. See ya.